Get up, DC. It's time for in other news. We take a look at the news stories that may not be on your radar, but they most certainly should be. You know I gotta start with Shauna Kenville. You saw the video of St. George, Utah, who went viral for all the wrong reasons after appearing and a video for an anti-mask rally saying, quote, George Floyd was saying, I can't breathe, and then he died. Now we're wearing a mask and saying, I can't breathe, but we're being forced to wear them. For real? Where is Aston Kutcher with the hidden cameras when you need them? There is privilege, there is ignorance, and then there's this. To compare a mild inconvenience with a man being choked to death by law enforcement is flat out unbelievable. Unless it happened in 2020. Evidently, nothing is unbelievable in this year. In other news, a shopper in the UK has gone viral for sharing a photo of the confusing instructions on the back of a wooden chopping board that he bought which actually say do not use as a chopping board. Do, really, do people really buy decorative chopping boards? This must be for folks who have nice kitchens but never actually cook. Maybe it's a board for a martial artist to chop through and they put it in the wrong section. The store claims it's an error on the sticker, which is actually way more logical than any scenarios I presented. Still, I would have loved to see people breaking these in the next karate gi, next, uh, next to the cheese graters and the dish towels. Karate Kid on deck. And finally, a photo of a couple's wedding proposal in front of Sleeping Beauty's castle at Disneyland has been mocked on social media for being unoriginal, as you can see another man proposing in the background of the photo at the exact same time. Awkward. Main man in the back couldn't wait a couple of minutes before making his move. He probably saw that somebody else was about to beat him to it and decided to just go for broke before his girl noticed the other couple. Disney is selling happily ever after dreams in these theme park streets. And shout out to all the men who would have been pressured into this proposal, but the park was closed. Hot Boy Summer is officially over. Let me know what you think of these stories using the hashtag GetUpDC.